Hello everyone, my name is Rahel Adriano, the Solution Architect with IAM Team, and today we're going to look at the uh, One Identity Manager solution from Dell. Now with the, the uh, version 7 release, Dell has enabled the uh, provisioning feature on the Active Directory edition of the product, and uh, that is what we will look at today. So in my environment here, I have installed the uh, Dell One Identity Manager um, Active Directory Edition, and I have also integrated it with the uh, um, Orange HRM, which is uh, what we will use as our HR system. So let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and uh, start adding our new employees into our uh, HR system. So our first new hire. Uh, We'll call him Eric Engineer. All right, Let's give him a profile picture. Now, Eric is a, Eric is an engineer, and he is in the uh, he's going to be in the engineering department. Okay, and um, that's uh, he's going to be reporting to Mike Manager. So he's going to be a, a a direct report to Mike Manager. Okay, and now for our uh, second new hire maybe we call him uh, Peter uh, Programmer give him a picture as well okay now for his job description uh, he's gonna be a programmer um, under the uh, web applications develop uh, web applications department, and maybe he's a contractor, so we'll we'll put a uh, end date for him. Uh, maybe through the end of May. And lastly, we're going to specify or identify his uh, supervisor is going to be reporting to Adam Admin okay now that we have entered our um, new hire data into the HR system the uh, next thing that needs to happen is for uh, identity manager to pull the data from Orange HRM now typically this is scheduled uh, once or multiple times in a day uh, really depending on, on what your requirements are. Alright, now that the Identity Manager has pulled the data from Orange HRM, um, we should be able to see our uh, new employees in the Manager 2. So let's look for, uh, let's try and look at the Eric Engineer first. So, um, we can see uh, Eric Engineer is in the uh, engineering department his manager is Mike manager and we also see he has an active directory account and an exchange mailbox now this is because of uh, policies I have set in identity manager um, I have said that uh, all employees automatically get an active directory account and also everybody in the engineering department uh, gets an exchange mailbox. Now if we drill down um, into his uh, identity data we can see the same uh, basically the same set of information that came from Orange HRM has been pushed down to um, Identity Manager. So his job description, uh, first name, last name, um, his department, um, his manager, and uh, even his picture, um, 
was pushed down into or was pulled by uh, identity manager from Orange HRM. And um, if we drill down into his uh, AD account, we will see that uh, he is his account is in the engineering OU. Um, he also belongs to the engineering group. Again, this is uh, these are all set uh, in Identity Manager, um, and these are all driven by the fact that uh, Eric belongs to the engineering department. Now, if we actually go to Active Directory and try to look for Eric, you can see he's in the Engineering OU. Uh, again, the same set of information from, from Orange HRM. Uh, was uh, pushed down to his uh, identity in, in identity manager and down to his active directory account um, we'll see account information his uh, job title department uh, and he belongs to that uh, engineering group okay now let's take a look at uh, how our other new hire, Peter, uh, Peter, let's see how he was processed. So basically the same, uh, all the information from Orange HRM uh, came down to Identity Manager. You'll notice he only has an AD account. He does not have an exchange mailbox. Uh, that is because I didn't have any uh, policies in place that uh, entitled him to uh, an exchange mailbox. And if we drill down to his uh, Active Directory account, you'll notice his account has an expiration date and basically uh, matches the uh, the uh, contract expiration that we have set for him in Orange HRM. The other thing you'll notice is uh, he belongs to the developers group in AD and again this is something that's uh, defined in Identity Manager. Um, I have set that uh, uh, everyone who belongs to the uh, web applications department automatically gets added to the developers group in Active Directory. Now, so the, the last thing uh, I'd like to show today is that when, when these accounts were created in Active Directory, uh, an email was sent, uh, notification emails were sent out to the manager of the employee. So you will see here uh, both Mike and Adam uh, both received two emails. One uh, letting them know that a new user account was created for their uh, subordinate, for their employee, and another email that uh, tells them or gives them the uh, initial password for the account. So uh, basically uh, in Mike's case he can give this uh, information to Eric so that Eric could log in and, and use his account. So that is it for our quick demo. Uh, thank you for watching. If you are interested in learning, uh, learning more about Dell Identity Manager or for any IAM needs Please email us at info at imteam.com or uh, visit us on the web at imteam.com. Thank you.